My name is Sabor Mirzodi. I'm at the Dell booth and I'm actually showcasing uh, a new trend that we've noticed in the industry. A lot of these cameras, uh, Canons, Sonys, Nikons, they all shoot 422 10-bit content. What does that mean? All these cameras shooting 422 10-bit uh, is a codec that's on these cameras that are very difficult to play back. And what I mean by playback is when we bring all that footage in to DaVinci Resolve or Premiere Pro, it's very difficult for the hardware to play that back. It's always CPU bound. Well, with NVIDIA's Blackwell generation, we actually accelerate that content on the hardware level. What does that mean? So to demonstrate that, what I did was I actually created a podcast uh, and typical podcast has a four camera shoot. And you have, for example, there's a shot right here, a uh, close up of me, close up of my buddy, a wide shot and a specialty shot. These are all 4K, 422, 10-bit clips that were directly off the camera. And in order to play it back, I wouldn't have been able to do these four camera streams without doing transcoding or proxy creation. In this case, I pulled them right out of the camera and you can see I'm playing all of these clips right off the camera with no transcoding, no proxy creation, no half resolution, nothing. Right off the camera, no problems at 422, 10-bit, 4K, 60 frames per second. Now. I wanted to take it a step further because this podcast is about tech and cars. So I was like, all right, this would be fun to take the car to the racetrack and outfit it with a bunch of cameras. So what I did was just to push it, I actually ended up grabbing nine of my cameras, went to the racetrack, and I was able to have all nine cameras right off the SD cards, a Canon R5, Sony a7R5, FX3, DJI Ronin 4D, which I'm actually controlling in the passenger seat, uh, GoPro Hero 13, an FX9, uh, another GoPro Hero, and even a Red Raptor shooting at 240 frames per second in Red Raw. All of this is log color. I'm color correcting all of this on the fly, and it's playing back with zero lag at 422 10-bit 4K 60 frames per second. So we have all nine cameras playing back, completely smooth, no frames dropped, and it's all being processed locally on an RTX Pro. That's what we can do with Blackwell, it's gonna accelerate pretty much every one of these camera manufacturers here. And it's one of the things that I've been most excited about because as a content creator, now I don't have to do transcoding, I don't have to do proxy creation, I don't have to burn so much time in, in creating all of that.